When you helped kickstart the Oasis Farmery, you were also helping to fund me. My name is Anna Mathis, and I'm a fiber artist. I love wool and yarn, I love making things with my hands, and I loved designing and creating these blankets for you. This past summer, I was asked by the Oasis Farmery to make blankets that were inspired by their aquaponic systems. And although you will see no hidden designs of fish in these intricate weaving patterns, the business philosophy and brand was amplified throughout this project's construction. These blankets were naturally dyed with bark, fruit, roots, and leaves. I used local goldenrod and onion skins to bring these rich hues to life. This kind of dyeing is a slow process and it takes days for the colors to bond with the fibers while they sit soaking up the warm sun. These blankets are cotton. I wanted them to be soft and light, a summer or a spring blanket to huddle up with on the porch. I chose to weave large diamond patterns. They sort of fade away when you're up close, but pop when you're sitting afar, building a grid like gardening plots. These blankets should be well loved and used. That is their purpose. But when they need to be cleaned, try spot cleaning, only washing the soiled sections. If you have to wash the blankets, do it by hand in very cold water and hang them flat to dry. But if you can, first try laying these blankets out on a patch of green grass for a day or two. This method seems to help clean and remove the stains naturally. Because of the natural dyes, try keeping these blankets in a shaded area when not in use. Over time, the cloth will soften and the colors will too. I hope you enjoy this handmade creation and I would love if you would email me a photo of your blanket in its new home. Thank you.